Now, for y'all that don't know, the projects was these big, massive apartment buildings that was in major cities, places like Chicago, New York. They had these massive buildings that are like, you know, 100 units in them or more. And this is where, you know, all people who didn't have a lot of money would stay. Now, originally they was built to um, be like a, like the next big promising community. But, you know, the government just built them to get everybody in there. And then once they got in there, it's like, you know, just lock them in there, they gone, and no more resources, cut them off, right? Get them in there, cut them off, let them fend for themselves. But anyway, um, so of course, there's places like this where you got a whole bunch of people who struggling. There's going to be a lot of crime going on because people going to turn to crime to either help them get through the day or to help them make some money to pay some bills. You know, either way, it's going to be a lot of folk resorting to crime. But now the worst, one of the worst things that was in there was a hit squad. Now it's two, it's two stories on the hit squad. Now the first story is that they was working for the government and what they do, they catch folk out at night. And if you get caught out at night, the government will basically send these folks to grab you, throw you in a van and carry you off somewhere. Now most of the time the people they carrying off was homeless people and, uh, you know, so you can mess with, so, you know, nobody's going to report you missing. All right? Another homeless person not going to go say, hey, I ain't seen old Jim down the street. Let me go make a report. No, you just going to assume that Jim went on to the next town and went down to another neighbor. You know, you're not going to, that's just how it go. You know, and um, plus police ain't going to believe a homeless person anyway. They walk in there, they going to cry risk putting get in jail themselves, man. So, and plus, people in the city mind their business, for one thing, man. You know, to another thing, man, folk keep their damn mouth shut in the city. Now, the second story behind this hit squad was that they was put there to scare, like, uh, help away police. Like, it would be stories of police getting shot at. Like, they even showed this in a movie, New Jersey Drive. They were standing on the roof of the projects. And the police car drove by, he had a revolver, man, and he just started firing at the police car. So a lot of times you would hear stories about snipers in the projects, man. So the, supposedly the hit squad was made to scare away uh, public service people, uh, social workers, police, even paramedics, firemen, they was called. They said the, the people would scare them away. So, you know, either way it goes, I guess, the projects was just you know, had this evil group working inside. 